of the reasons why your YouTube shorts is not hitting the short shelf and getting hundreds or thousands or millions of views is number one, you got the wrong spelling of shorts in your title or description. Now, YouTube recommends that you put hashtag shorts in the title or description, though it doesn't guarantee that your video will make it to the short shelf because you did that, but you are increasing your chances of showing up there. I've seen people that spell shorts in two or more different ways. You see hashtag short, no S at the end. And I have also seen people spell hashtag shorts. So there is a mix up of the S and the T. And you'd see that if you've fallen victim to misspelling of the shorts, you're not alone. Tons of other channels are making the same mistake. How many channels spell shorts? Well, over 3,000 channels. And what about those that use hashtag short without the S at the end? Over a million channels do that. And you might say, Cubs then, hang on, I'm looking at some of the channels on the screen and it seems they are having decent number of views. I agree with you. But what if they spelt this just the way YouTube recommended and they are having a ton more views than what they have? Also, why spell it another way if this is what YouTube recommends? So take note of the spellings that you are putting in your title or description. Reason number two is that you are making 60 seconds video. Yes, yes, your videos have to be under a minute, meaning 59 seconds or less because YouTube rewards you with an extra second for making a YouTube short. So a 59 second video ends up being 60 seconds. So make it 59 seconds or less. The only exception to this is if you're using the YouTube shorts camera, though you still get the extra second, it will still be considered a short. But as majority of the world still do not have the short camera, please ensure that when you're making your shorts, it is 59 seconds or less. So reason number three, you are creating horizontal videos. Have a look at the video you see on the screen. It is 55 seconds, but it fills up the entire screen. It is not a YouTube shorts video. Yes, it is less than a minute. Yes, I can decide to put hashtag shorts in the title or description, but this is not a short because it fills up the entire screen. Shorts have to be vertical or square for it to be considered a short from YouTube point of view. And if you want to know if your videos made it into the YouTube short shelf, go to the analytics of any of your YouTube shorts videos, right? On the right hand side, you should see either shorts. If you don't see it here, that's fine. Go and check the reach tab and scroll down to see if you see shorts as a traffic source. If you don't see it listed here, it could well be that it did go to the short shelf, but it wasn't listed as the top six or five traffic sources that you have. So click on see more to drill down to see if it made it there. Now, if you want to find out if your video is actually a short before it goes public, check out the shorts video that is popping up at the top of the screen. Let's move on. Now, let's say your shorts are vertical, they are less than 60 seconds, and you have the spelling right, hashtag shorts in the title and description, but your video is just not hitting the short shelf, or it's hitting there, but it's not staying there. What could be the reason? Well, it could just mean that it is still cooking and you need to give it time to take off. You've boarded the plane, but it's not yet time for takeoff. So give it time. Now look at this video I made on the 8th of November 2020. It got 290 views in the first 24 hours of its upload. Not a single view of that almost 300 views was from the short shelf. A week after, 722 views. A month after, almost 3000 views. And today it's almost 15k views and majority of these views are from the short shelf. This video has made several trips in and out of the short shelf. So please do not throw in the towel if your video is not yet on the short shelf or it isn't performing, even if it's not a YouTube short. It might still be on a journey. It might just have boarded the plane and it's just on the journey to take off. Now, another reason your short is not staying on the shelf, which is I consider the most important reason, is that the content isn't great. That's just the plain truth. Don't shoot the messenger. Just hang on and bear with me. 
Now, the content is either boring in the delivery or it's not a topic that people are interested in. We all make content that is bad or not great, myself included. But it's not a bad thing because YouTube is a process. It's a journey. You don't have to be great in order to start making great content. But you have to start in order to make great content. And in starting to make great content, you will make bad content. Bad content paves the way for you to improve your skills in order to make great content. So start looking at areas on how you can improve your content delivery. What can you remove? What can you add to make your video much greater than what it is? If your 60 seconds video is shown to viewers on the short shelf and people are not watching up to 10 seconds, 20 seconds, 30 seconds worth of the video, then it doesn't make any sense from a business standpoint for YouTube to keep promoting it on the short shelf. I suggest as a starting point, check your top performing videos in terms of audience retention and see what you can learn from what you did right and replicate it for the new videos. If you're looking for tips on how to keep your viewers watching longer, check the video at the right hand side. Or you can just ignore all that completely and select the video that YouTube is recommending for you to watch. Let me know in the comment section if you have any more tips and thank you so much for watching if you've made it this far. I will see you next time.